All right, guys, so we have Weekend League rewards, Division Rivals rewards, and a bit of a different video. I'm going to put in some highlights from my Weekend League. Now, we did finish on a certain rank, which I'll get to in a minute, but there's footage here playing. So I won this game, and it was 19 wins. I believe there's six games left. Yeah. So it's going to come up on the screen here now. It's... Yeah, so 19 games, six games left. You know, everything was going well. This was probably the best Weekend League I've ever had. Actually, no, I take that back. It's the second best weekend league I've ever had because I have actually finished Elite in the past. But in terms of, but at the time when I finished Elite that first time, I won nine games and I bounced to get it and it was on a Monday. But anyway, game number 20, not game number 20 rather, this was win number 20. But I get a corner, I put it in, Ed Emilitao gets it and it's 1-0. And then up the other end, Johan Cruyff, he gets fouled from behind. From Los Amateurs, a free kick, step up with Roberto Carlos. Now, there is a free kick tutorial on the website for how I scored, but you aim it in the top corner, green time at Roberto Carlos, 99 free kick accuracy. Boom, 2 0, and that's a race crit, and that was win 20. So, that was game number 25. So, that's 20 wins with five games left. All I needed to do was win three games from the next five to get elite. So, let's get into the remaining five games. So, Match number 26, I got destroyed, I'm not even going to lie. You'll see the stats in a minute. He was probably a top 100 player, but he absolutely slaughtered me. He had team of the year Neymar, team of the season, sorry, Neymar, team of the season Mbappe. He just, he was too good. None of him on loan either. So then game number 27, we go up against this guy, who has a pretty decent team. Um, He's got a full BPL team, but I... I mean, I was the better player. We went in at half time, and he was three 0 up. He had three shots on target, three goals. I had five, I think it was, and none. I made a few changes. I went attacking. You'll see the formation that I was playing here. Then in the forty seventh minute, I get the ball with Ribery to Pogba, Pogba through to Ribery, Ribery down the line, fake shot stop. Yep, a little waiting for the attacking movements, and I did get lucky. Nelson Semedo interception, pass it to Ronaldo. Another more luck there. Nice little ball roll there. Pogba left foot, boom in. That's 3-1. Then, in the 52nd minute, he gets a corner. I win it. Ribéry to Messi. Messi with passed to Delaney. Delaney over the top. He does, it does get intercepted, but he should have passed it back to the goalkeeper or ran it up. But instead, Ribéry intercepts. And no ball roll needed there. And that's 3-2. Then, from his kickoff, I intercept the pass. Messi to Pogba. Pogba sees the run of Ronaldo. Ronaldo with a fake shot. Runs. And that front post is open, as always. And that's it. It's 3-3. Then he's attacking here. A nice little interception from Mendy. Mendy to Delaney. Delaney with a nice free ball down the line. I love Delaney. Such a great player. To George Best. And this is a weird goal that I scored here. A little L1 circle cross. And now Ribéry is probably the shortest guy on the pitch. Somehow scores that in ahead of Edem Militao, I think it was. I had to watch a replay because I thought it was an own goal. But if you look, he heads it into the ground, which is what takes it over, Alisson. But that was a remarkable goal. Then he was... Just passing the ball around the back here. Delaney intercepts. Pogba. Pogba into Ribéry. Ribéry far post. And that was it. 3-0 down at half time. 76 minute. 5-3. And he rage quits. So that was win 21. So that was win 21. And from here, I was feeling confident. I'm not even going to lie. Um, you'll see now 21 wins, 3 games left. I only needed 2 wins from the last 3 games. Now, the next game is going to come up now. But at this point, I was getting, I was feeling the nerves. I was getting a bit sweaty. Um, I think I took a break to go and have some lunch. Had a nice little pizza. And then I came back. And then we got into game number 20. What would that be? 27? Or, sorry, no, 28 would be in it. Yeah, so they come up against this team. Now, this is a pretty decent team, I guess. He's got the SEN. He's got the prime Pele from the SBC, probably. And the team of the season... De Bruyne and Messi, it's actually a very good team. Everyone's on full chem. So we got into this game and straight from kickoff, back to Keane. Keane plays it up to Ferlin Mendy. Ferlin Mendy waits for the run. L1 triggers the run. There we go. Free ball. He's in. He holds him off. And front post, boom. 1-0. 1 minute and 37 seconds in. Then he gets a corner. Roy Keane, inter what an interception that was. He sees that run of George Best, plays it into Ronaldo, Ronaldo into Best. I'm running, I'm running, am I going to ball roll? No, I'm just going to do a little finesse and then slides it into the corner. What a finish. Then in 22nd minute, his Messi gets through, 
I was waiting for the ball roll, but he shoots with his weaker foot and somehow it goes in. And then this happens. I don't know what happened. It was such a rush challenge. Maldini comes in and it's a straight red. And here I was bricking it. I'm not even going to lie. But I did make a substitution. I think I took off my cam. Brought on, yep, Mbabu there. He went to centre-back. Maldini went to cam. And then this happens. A nice little free ball from Pogba. Lionel Messi is through on goal. This time there is a ball roll. And it's a goal. 3-1. In the 65th minute so that's all we have for the footage you'll see here that i was on 22 wins with two games remaining it quickly goes away now i don't have the footage for the remaining two games and the reason for that was because the next game that i went into i was winning 2-1 and to be honest with you i should have just held possession for those 15 minutes but i've never been that sort of person he equalized and then he actually got the winning in the final minute and he won that game then it was went down to the final game it was 22 wins However many losses, one game left, I had to win. I was actually 2-0 up at half-time. And then at half-time, he brings on team of the season, Ben Yedda. I don't know who has him on the bench. Team of the season, Ronaldo and team of the season, Messi. The latter two on loans. Then he actually goes up 2-2. It's 3-2 to him. I equalise in the 93rd minute, I think it was. The last kick of the game. He was wasting time. I intercepted. I equalised. Then he goes into extra time. Then in the 98th minute, I think, I take the lead. And I'm dominating the rest of the game. I should have won this game. 100% should have won it. And then it was in the 118th minute. And then what happened was I got a throw in. Now I should have just threw it out of play. But I threw it to my player. And he got intercepted. He went straight down the line and he scored. And it was such a sweaty goal as well. And it was 4-4. I went into penalties. And then he won on penalties. Um, I missed an easy penalty with Ronaldo. I was aiming for the top corner and he missed. I should have just put it in the bottom corner. He would have went in. I saved two of his penalties. I missed one penalty. He saved two of mine. He scored the last one and he won. And then that was it, really. 22 wins we ended on. It was really disappointed. I was salty. I was really salty. Um, but we move. We learn. In the future, I'm going to need to learn to be more ruthless. To waste more time, I guess. But that's what we had. We had 22 wins and 8 losses. Um, it was the best week in league I've probably played. Even though I've got 23 wins in the past, that was a fluke 23 wins. Whereas this one, I should have really had 24 wins. Maybe even 25 but that's the way the cookie crumbles. We got 22 wins, gold one. And now let's get into the rewards. Right, so here we are, foot champions rewards. I'm going to go ahead and redeem these. There's also division rivals rank one probably, but we'll find out. Foot champions weekend league, gold one. I'm so disappointed I didn't get elite. But we do get two players, pick special items, two jumbo rare player packs, 50k and 2000 champions qualifying points. The two picks are going to be important because one of them is going to be a guaranteed 90 plus from the top four leagues. So we're going to go ahead and see who we get. Number one, let's go. <laughs> I say the big, but I mean, it's Smalling. I mean, it's not any debate. I'm going to have to go and take Smalling because he's the highest rated and he's going to make for great fodder. But he's not going to get into the starting lineup, nowhere near. Matt Williams looking all right. Ben Tanko, I think that's the future stars card. Yeah, I've actually used him. He's actually a pretty decent card, but I'll go ahead and take the small in. And then and then we'll see what we get in the second pick. Right, player pick number one. Well, number two, but... Wow. <laughs> I got this Rafa twice last week. Joswiak, Mitrovic and Parejo, really? So this is the one pick that's guaranteed in the top five leagues over 90. Man, that is so disappointing. So disappointing. All that grinding for nothing. Guess we're going to have to take Parejo because it's easier to link. But that was highly underwhelming. Highly, highly underwhelming. I'm gonna, I am gonna. don't even know if you can see um, what rank I got for last week. Is there any way to check? Okay, so this is for Champs Rewards. We'll take this one. Yeah, so I think it was Division 4 as well. Which is good. Yep, rank 1. Perfect. Now, we'll register here. Is there a way to check to show what I got last week? I thought there would be. Um, view rewards, no schedule. No. Um, no, there isn't until it starts, I believe. Oh, there we go. 22 and 0. 
All right, so we're going to move into the packs. We're going to open the Jumbo Premium Gold Packs first. Then we're going to do the Mega Packs, then the Rare Packs, then the Jumbo Rare Players Packs. So, Jumbo Premium Gold Pack number one. It's nothing really. It is Suchek. Is there anything else in there? No. Um, they're all untradeable, so I'm going to flip them out and then put them in the transfer list because there should be marquee matchups tonight. Champions League and Europa League going on. Right, the second one. Again, nothing here again. That's Bafetin Bigomis. Same thing again, transfer list, any tradable items, any untradables, straight into the quick sell. So we're moving on to Jumbo Premium Gold Pack number three. And we have nothing, it's not even a rare gold. Well, it is a rare gold, but yeah, it's one of them packs, everything's going to be quick sell there. Jumbo Premium Gold Pack number four. So far, it's been a horrific pack opening. I'm not even going to lie. It's Sacco. And it's just getting worse. It's just getting worse. Like, why on earth EA didn't put all the team of the seasons in packs? It's honestly, I'll never know. It's the most stupidest decision that company's made in years. Right, so. Was that a mega pack? It was. And there's nothing of note in there either. So. This is Mega Pack number two. This is also untradeable. I think it's Division Rival Rewards. In this pack, we get. It's a big flare, but it's a nothing flare. We get Pedro, who's played his last game for Chelsea, actually. He's. I don't know if he's leaving or retiring, but he's definitely leaving. Right, we're going to move on to the Rare Players pack. This first one, it's not even a board. Wow, these packs are really something, aren't they? Everything's going to be quick sold or put into the transfer list. Rare players pack number two. Finally, a board. Spanish. That's bad. Cam. Luis Alberto. Yes. Now, this should be his 97 version. But why isn't the 97 version in packs EA? Tell me why. Right. Because the packs have been so crap, I'm going to throw in a 90 plus team of the season rated player. So let's see who we get. We have. Team of the season flair, obs. Dutch. Centre back, centre back. Right back. Win it. Dumfries? Wow, 90 rated. Wow. They should have just called it a 90 pack. What an L. Is he even worth anything? Let me have a quick look. <laughs> I'm not gonna quick sell him. He's 80k. He's discard value. Alright, we're also gonna throw in a Prime or Moments Icon player pack. Right, let's see who we get. I mean, at least minimum be a moments player. Right, come on. Come on. Dutch. Come on, centre forward. Cent centre back. Coleman. <sighs> Ronald Coleman. Well, at least it's a prime icon, eh? Sorry, moments icon. And he's worth... Oh, wow. 650, did I see one there? 620, 600, 596. So he's actually worth the cost of the pack, almost. I think he's worth a bit more, but that price will obviously come down. But that's a decent pull, I guess. Um, I'll give him a few games to test him out. He's got 80 pace. He's got 90 shooting, wow. He's probably a, he'd be a great CDM. Um, but I can't really put him at CDM and play anyone at CDM at centre-back. If I had the shapeshifter and Bobby, maybe. But yeah, he's high-medium. Pace isn't the greatest, fair enough, he'll go into the club. Maybe he'll go into another icon moments SPC, I don't even really know. But we've got two packs left, we've got two Jumbo Rare Players packs left. They're both tradable, because they were from my 22-8 my twenty two and eight finish. So this one is a board, is that Pjanic? It is, Barcelona's Pjanic. Is there anything else in the pack? Santi Cazola, Zapata, Kovacic, you see that should have been his team of the season as well. But that's it. Let's go into the last Jumbo Rare Players pack. We need a team of the season, at least one, to save this, to salvage this pack opening. Or a walkout. Wow, not even a walkout. It's a board. And it's own honor. There can't even be anything in the pack that's worth anything because it's an 85. Right, well, that was a very underwhelming pack opening. I grinded to 22 wins. Should have been 23. Maybe it would have been different. Who knows? But we end on 22 wins. We end with Rafa. We end with Smalling. Dumfries, Prime Moments, Ronald Coleman, Onana, and Jesse Lingard. Well, that's it, really. I've got nothing else to add. 
Now I'll probably will be playing weekend league again purely because I'm I'm addicted to FIFA, aren't I? Um, I am playing. I've, I have bought Ghost of Tsushima, so if I can be able to play that, and they've got a premium gold players pack here. Look at the odds of them. Shape shift. Look at that. Less than one percent. Like that's criminal. Like they need to. Something needs to be done about that, and I hope in FIFA Twenty One something is done. Like that's just that's ridiculous, man. That's stupid. Don't buy packs ever. Just don't buy packs. This is the team I'm going to be rocking. So, you know, this is the team I'm using for the Ansu Fatty SB. If you like the video, leave a comment, share the video, like the video. Most importantly, subscribe. And until the next video, peace.